Welcome back to part two. We're actually going to do the compression test and see how much spark we got. Um, so yeah, let's get into it. Turn the fuel off here. See what kind of spark we got, eh? So we get about there, which is not much. So it's not a huge spark, but it starts. If you see the state of the ignition stuff, you can understand that, but it works, so uh, how much do you need? Enough to work. Right, let's do the old compression test. Of course, the great thing about the old Fergies is all the tools you need live in the box here. So we'll go out our spark plug wrench. running pretty um pretty average eh? but then we are kind of running at least 30 percent diesel in there so it's, it's awesome Cylinder, got the throttle open. Let's see what we got, eh? What's that? Uh, 50, 60, 70, 80, 89 psi for cylinder four, we'll call it. Right, cylinder three. What we got? Similar, that's about 85. Number two. Best one yet, 100. Last one, number one. Around the hundred. Alright, just gonna double check the first one, which is number four. And we'll pop some oil in there and see what it does as a wet test. Here's about 89 still, so we'll just pop some oil in there. See if that comes up a lot with, with some better sealed rings. Pop about a teaspoon full of oil in there. Oh, I'll screw it in a bit. Just 
a wet test. Uh, not really changed, so it needs a good valve job, I suppose. And some new rings and, and the like. Pop that out. Right, so we're testing spark on one. Might just do it on one more just to see, but they're all going to be pretty average, I'm guessing. See how much of a jolt I can get. Answers that question, eh? Got the arms right now. I'll fix it up. And give it a screw it anyway. There's your air intake. Our compression test, which between 89 and 100 psi, uh, didn't matter if we put some oil in to kind of improve sealing of the rings. Um, 89 to 100 psi, I'll figure out what it should be, uh, but that's not terrible, probably, but we'll see. And in terms of spark, not a lot of spark, which you saw the state of the ignition components, that's fair enough. Um, so, yeah, we'll see where we go with that. But right now, I've got the loader arm stuck up and I can't get them down, so I'm gonna figure that out and uh. We'll see you for whatever happens next. Yeah.